Yuenyang is a county with an area of 2,200 square kilometers with a population of approximately 365,000 people. Yuenyang is mostly known for its beautiful mountain terraces. Farmers Club is operating in seven administrative villages in Shalato Township, which is located in the west of Yuenyang County. Shalato has a population of 21,198 people, with 3,127 households living below the poverty line. It is a mountainous area and has typical karst landscape, which cannot keep water and the layer of the soil is too thin to preserve water, thus making this a restraint to farming production. Shalato receives a total of 1,200 to 2,000 millimeters of rainfall per year. In addition, the evaporation is bigger than the rainfall. In this case, water is one of the main problems in this area which needs to be resolved. The project started in November 2010. In cooperation with the European Union and Humana People to People Spain, an agreement was made to start up this project with 2,200 farmers. The main purpose of the Farmers Club is to increase the income of the farmers. As soon as farmers increase their income, our experience is that they will spend the money wisely in improving their houses, in education and health. The farmers in Shalato have had a traditional way of growing their crops which gave a low yield. With the Farmers Club, we want to improve the agricultural production in Shalato. The farming instructors and program officers go out and give courses to the farmers on how to grow rice in a modern way. The traditional way was that of planting rice closely packed together. Now the farming instructors teach them to make rows of 26 by 16 centimeters apart to give free movement of air for the plants. They also teach the farmers to maintain the water level in the field at 3 centimeters deep. If the water exceeds that depth, then the farmers have to take it out by digging some outlets. Each farmer is entitled to a plot of 1.6 more. Close monitoring and frequent visits to the farmers is helping to maintain the standards and making sure the crops are maintained in a proper way. In this way, the project expects the farmers to get an increase in their yield of more than 20%. The project leader, three project officers and five farming instructors work very hard in developing the farming techniques for the farmers in Shalato. The farmers have a plot in the dry part of the area where they grow maize. Each farmer has a plot which measures two more. Farmers Club has helped the farmers to grow maize in a better way by using organic manure and taking care of the maize by continuously weeding. The project leaders, farming instructors, as well as program officers visit the farmers frequently to give them training and demonstrations. A few farmers still need to be mobilized to use modern methods because they still prefer using the traditional way since they think this is not time consuming. There is need for continuous mobilization so as to do away with this traditional way of doing things. The farmers get weekly training from farming instructors and program officers. Many children in Yuenyang have no access to preschool education. In other Humana People to People projects, we have seen how preschools have given children from remote and poor areas a much better start on their education than if they start straight in primary school. Most children in Yuenyang speak the minority language. To be able to follow the studies in primary school, it is important for the children to learn Mandarin. Farmers Club Yuenyang has taken an initiative to open three preschools with a total of 100 children enrolled to start at the beginning of June 2010. The plan is to start 10 preschools in all. This move will help to prepare the children better for the primary school. 
The slogan of the preschools is to prevent poor children from becoming poor adults. Farmers Club is working hard in improving the livelihood of the Shalato community by improving all the areas in health, food production, education and raising the income of the families.